Hello everyone and welcome back to the most inconsistent um, channel ever. Be sure that you join a Discord that I'm working on. It's called Joysticks and it's very purely decent, very most definite. It's basically for all types of gamers and it will be linked in the description down below. I'm the guy with the name of a fruit and the head of one too. And I'm proud to present my 50 subscriber special. Well, heck. Anyways, welcome to a new series that I'm calling GTIAD, or Google Translate is a disaster. Basically, how this works is that we take a phrase, put it to the Google Translate mach machine, then we copy it, paste it, copy it, paste it, and once again, copy it, or no, paste it, ah, and so it turns to hello people who for some reason still see this, instead of hello people who are for some reason still watching this. Not that big of a difference, but it is a difference indeed. Our first sentence was submitted by the owner of Joysticks himself, Yure, submitting Fortnite means Lion King in Swedish, translated to Korean. And so we're going to translate it to Dutch, because we like to make fun of people here. And then we're going to do Korean. And then we'll just do the Maltese. And let's see our end result. Fortress means the Lion King in Swedish. Ah, oh, no! It worked! Wait, 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 let me try something, let me try something. This might work. Let me try this one. And then translate again. Hopefully it does not give us the same result. And... This is not English! This is not English. I know English, and this is not English. Something go wrong? What the heck? The only thing that changed between them is that there is a space and that it says alone. So I guess our end result is space is alone. And our next one is submitted by Heckery, and it says, I'm definitely not trying too hard to come up with something about Simba getting a victory royale. That was hard to say. Let's see what happens. Okay, so we translate it from English to Spanish. I don't think it's going to make much of a difference if we leave it there, and so we won't. We're going into Russian, and if we need to, then we'll also do this form. And this one, I don't know what to do. So, I'm pretty sure we did Igbo last time, or something along those lines, so, Igbo. Okay. Let's see how it turns out. In fact, I'm not trying my best to raise the issue of Simba to victory. This is, this is what we like to see. Very good. Now I want to try this. Let's see if there's any difference. Let's see. Yep, no difference, but still really funny. So there is no more suggestions, because of course there wasn't. So I, I made my own. It's been exactly a year since my first Google Translate is a disaster video came out. It got about 33 views and gave me no subscribers. Why am I making this video? It's troubles of YouTube. And so that was Italian, and so we're going to bring it into Irish. Irish is epic. And then to Czech. And then to English. 
It's been a year since my first Google Translator came out with an emergency video. It got 30 opinions and doesn't give me subscribers. Why am I making this video? Yes, I made the Google Translator. So, I was, um, reflecting over how Spring Man from ARMS is coming to Super Smash Bros. Or maybe not, we'll find out. So I put, Spring Man springs over with a spring in his step. You feel sprung. It springs, the flowers are springing into action as Spring Man gets into Smash Bros. Oh wait, no, it's probably going to be Helix. Heck. I just trying to fit as many spring as I can. So, we may get into Persian, or Persian, because that's a cool Pokemon. I don't know how... Yeah, that's how I do it. Okay. And then to Tarjeet, I think. And also there's something under that, which is the same thing except actual words. And then we have Swedish. And then back to English. Let's see. The spring man stares at the stairs. You feel expensive. In the spring, when Spring Man enters Spring Bros, the flowers bloom. Oh, don't wait. It could be Helix to heck. <laughs> Why? Why do you hate Helix so much? He's a good boy. Also, it says, oh, don't wait, not oh, wait. I don't know if I said that, but... Eh. So now, I'm gonna try take the bottom half of this, and wait, I can see if it's any different. Because I'm going to stretch this to over 10 minutes, or I'm dead. Oh wait, that's it. So apparently the word ones just don't work. You feel overwhelmed. The narrow sea. Okay, I think it's just this part that I want to see. The narrow season, a whore, when the man, the whore, bats, rose, rose, comes in yellow. Okay, no, I can't read any of this. So, um, this is, Ozzy is one of the characters in Animal Crossing, and, um, he's one of the characters in my village, and, um, he's terrible, and he does not deserve human rights. Because one, he's a koala. Two, he said but in an Animal Crossing game. The foul word that might get me demonetized in an Animal Crossing game. It's terrible. And three, he likes his feet. A lot. That scares me. Also, I don't understand what this definition is. Ozzy don't deserve human rights because like, one, he has a koala, two, and there's nothing else changed but those. And so we're, we're gonna copy the Zulu, enter, and then copy the German, and then copy the Thai, and then English. Ozzy does not abandon human rights. He is a koala. Second, shows the butt and in the game of air of crossing the animals. And the third, he likes his feet. Very that is very good. Very good. I still hate Ozzy. Or I'm sorry, Ozzy. But it's funny. Very funny. And to push this past 10 minutes, I'm going to talk to you guys about just some things that I plan on doing in the future of this channel. Also, I made very cool art that you see right now of me, and it's based off of the Mario and Luigi games, and I think it looks very good. Okay, so, uh, I have made a new, um, N-O-O-O -O -O intro, which is my first video I ever posted. The only thing is, I don't know how to, like, get the right music and all that. And I made it, like, a year ago. But if you guys really want to see it, then 
Yeah, I'll, I guess I'll try to do it. And maybe I'll even make another Smash character concepts, because that was really fun. And I watched it again last night, and I realized how outdated it was, and how bad it was. But my friend Yure, he says that I'm doing a very good job. He says that the, um, the presentation thing that I'm going for with the Google Slides is very good. I live off of Google Slides and pancakes. That is my motto from now on, and you cannot change it. So if you guys have, if like the three of you guys watching this right now have any ideas for characters I should do for Smash Character Concepts, then leave them in the comments down below. They have to actually have a chance of getting in Smash Bros, and I have to know them. Like, know the characters. So sadly, no hat kid. Not having any Hat Kid, because if I believe right, Hat Kid is an indie game. Hat, or a Hat of Time is my favorite game, by the way. Yeah, I do have some big plans that I'll be done in like 20 years, so stay tuned for that, I guess. Uh, so yeah, be sure to sign up for me. It's free, and you can change your mind later. It would be very helpful if you could go to your five alter accounts and make my views. Also, please video. I'm an old life without ca old cartoons, slides, and puzzles. Mirna, out.